Driveway cracks happen because of soil settlements or lack of appropriate reinforcement. Water is one of the main causes of soil erosion and soil settlement. So no gaps should be left open on driveways. Expansion joints and cracks should be watertight to extend the life of concrete driveways. Outdoor cracks move together with temperature and soil changes. So to seal a crack, you need a flexible yet strong material. Polyurethane sealants have proven to fit right in. But first we have to prep the crack. We open the crack and remove all loose material using a V-shaped concrete blade. If the crack is not opened, material won't fill the crack. All residues of dust and loose particles must be removed from inside the crack. This can be done with a blower. If the crack is too big, it should be filled with backer rod or sand. Always making sure that the upper side walls of the crack are free of particles. The sealant must maintain flexibility to stay in the cracks. And that is only achieved when the sealant thickness is less than its width. Then we apply the polyurethane to carefully fill the top of the cracks. Polyurethanes can be found in self-consolidating or non-sag consistencies. Self-consolidating sealants require more experience to achieve a clean job, but since they don't have to be troweled in, we can make a cleaner job. Since cracks are poured flush with the driveway surface, vehicles can damage the aesthetics of the sealant. So we broadcast a fine layer of sand over the fresh sealant to protect the repair against dirt and hot tire pickups. We let the sand sit for no more than one or two minutes and then the excess is removed. The top sand provides a better look on the repair as it matches the concrete surface better. The application of sealant in cracks is not a structural fix, nor replacing the reinforcement that your driveway needs to keep the concrete together. But it is a fast and inexpensive way to slow down the deterioration of your driveway.